Hey everybody, hello, how are you? Do you see what I see? Do you see the hand? I put the hand back on, we're slowly, well, I got another hand and I put it on and all I have to do now is cover up those four patches of paint that are missing. It's not even funny, really, I don't know why I'm laughing. And we'll be all good with a background. Some kind, and then I kind of have to get rid of all these pillows back here. But right now we're in the middle of a bunch of pillows. And let's put the hey everybody pillow. We talk about feelings here. Somebody told me that I was talking too much again. I'll, and I just wanted to take this pillow and kind of shove it in their face and say, we talk about feelings here. Read the pillow. No, I don't sell this. It was given to me as a gift. It's got my channel name on it. Hey, everybody. And some of my um, catchphrases. In the beginning, when I was doing Timu hauls, and Timu was really new to me, I kept saying wish. Did I say wish again? Anyway, my hair is already sticking up now. That's nice. Stop it. Stop it. All right. I've got a bag with three... Oh my gosh, orders in it. Smile, cheese. Eh, look at my arms trembling as I try to hold it up. <laughs> okay, what what am I wearing? I got this on Timu a long time ago. I don't know what it's called or where the link is, so please don't ask me for it. And I'm wearing it with black leggings and I'm wearing it with my red earrings that I hauled yesterday. These are sold out, so... I can't give you this link either. I'm sorry. And then I've got this from HRH Collection. It's a YouTube channel and she sells jewelry. And then uh, Mimi, Diane from Mimi's Life gave me this bracelet for Christmas and a matching necklace and earrings and everything. So, and then I've got my Gona jewelry beaded charm bracelet on with it. To, and no, my nails are still not done. Okay, that's a rundown of my outfit of the day. And I wore these with those black fuzzy boots that I showed you yesterday. Let's see what's in the bag. Two minutes and 34 seconds. Okay, there's already something in styrofoam. Oh, dear. All right, first let's shake it. All right, I don't hear a lot of pieces so that's a good sign. So, Uh-oh. Why is my phone sliding around? What's happening here? Okay, I know what this is. So, so you know what I'm going to do? You know what? I'm going to find the order that it's in. There it is. Whoop. There it is. Show more order information. Gosh, Timu, you make it so hard. And I'm really not happy about the fact that there, here comes a hot flash. Let's see if it turns my whole body red. I'm really not happy about the new set. Of, oh, no, I'm not happy about three orders in this one bag. That messes up my content. One order per video, please. So what I'm going to do is do this for about an hour. And then if we're still, and then I'll save the rest of this for tomorrow or something. But what about your reviews? I'll get them done soon. I got, okay. So we're cracking, oh, oh gosh. Really? It, it's another mug. Oh, I forgot the garbage bag. That should be a saying. I forgot the garbage bag. Always forget the garbage bag. Where am I going to put this? Throw it out over there. I had a dream last night. Well, hold on. Let me show you this. Okay. First of all, I saw this and I thought it was so cute. And I thought, look, I've got to drink my coffee out of this thing. Look at the handle. Look at the handle. <laughs> it's awesome. Little girl with antlers or something. I don't really know what's going on. <laughs> with the picture that it looks like a child 
drew but there are flowers all the way around and then there she is again and you see the little blue sky and the inside is white and the handle the handle in the bottom is just plain no maker's mark or artist's name or anything like that but look at that handle you guys i can't i can't get over how Ooh, it's you could actually use this to drink soup out of too I don't know. That is a coffee mug. Now, I'm not going to be able to get away with going, but mom, we've always had this mug. She's going to be like, yeah, hell no. The handle itself is going to take up the space of a whole other mug in the cupboard. And like, we just are running out of room for mugs. And my, I think we should kind of throw away all her mugs because they're just like, random mugs that she's gotten from businesses and stuff. I'm not throwing them away. Donate them. And my mugs are carefully curated, as you know. Now, that mug right there, how many times can I say the word mug in one paragraph of a conversation? That mug, I paid $12.14 for it. I got a price reduction on it. But it's still $12.14. And you can choose from a bunch of different colors oh no the only one that's left now is the black mug and the rest are sold out and the black mug this is so sophisticated don't look at my fingernails looks like this try to scoot it up and i actually was going to order that one but i liked the girl with the antlers on her head and the cheery pink handle and I like the colors on this so all right so there's that we got that what's next oh lord I'm trying to pick something that is in this order so I don't have to go skipping around I'm not gonna just forget it just pull something out of here okay I think that this is Whoa, all right, oops, another bag. Why though, what is my problem? I, I have a bag problem. You can never have enough, one for every outfit, different outfit a day, different bag every day. So this is really big. Now wait, this might be a different one. I got, this is not the droid I was looking for. This is not the bag that I, I thought it was. Okay, this bag is a huge bag and it's got this furry fleece here. And am I happy with it? I don't know, man. This part, this stuff looks kind of yuck. Not yuck, but... I don't know, but there should be a smaller bag. So it's a tote bag. It snaps open and closed. It's fleece lined. And then inside of it is a smaller. Oh, it smells horrible. There's a smaller bag inside. And inside this bag, there's a surprise. I'm joking. Inside this bag. Oh, the zippers, though, are... It's not going to open because, oh, I did it. I did it. I did it. Inside this bag, there's a little strap for this bag. So if you want to run around with this, you can. But I mean, I'm not thrilled with this material right here. This is not what I thought it would be. It It's not meeting my expectations. But... You know, it's fine. I think it was about $22. Let me see. I know I shopped around for it because I saw it everywhere. And I saw it and saw it and saw it. And it was like, you know, it was brainwashing me. It was brain. It was a brainwashing technique because I kept seeing it everywhere. And finally I said, oh, all right. And I put it in my cart. They were just going to show it to me and show it to me and show it to me until they finally broke me down into buying it. I don't know where it is. Now, we're not doing this today with three orders in one bag. 
No, that's not it. You guys, I have some Amazon stories to tell you. I got into it with Amazon today. Can you, if you're new to my channel, hi. Did I already say hi? I'm Erin. This is my channel. Hey, everybody. And I named it Hey, Everybody because I like to start every video going, Hey, everybody. I don't know. When I initially named this channel, it didn't have a purpose. It was just a run in my mouth of vlogging my non-existent life channel. Now we just shop here. And yeah, sometimes we do product reviews. This bag, okay, I finally got this bag for $16.68. So I feel a little bit better. And I got a price reduction on it. And it's still $16.68, and you can get it in brown and black, but my honest review of it is that this, this material is very strange. I don't even know what to call it. I thought it was going to be like a soft faux suede, but it's like a, it's like a foamy kind of, it makes me make this face. So there's that. That's the only way I really know how to explain it with a face. But don't do that for too long. That's going to make my wrinkles worse. I'm going to get so many wrinkles because of this channel. Because I'm always moving my, my face animated in an animated way. Okay, so there, that was kind of like a fail. And, but you know, we live and we learn I got this from my mom for her birthday, so I'm glad it's here. It's a tiny little vegetable murder board. It's a tiny little, um, oh no, she's right down there. I hope she didn't hear me. Stop with the glare. It's a cutting board and it's got different animals. I mean, I'm sorry, animals, vegetable, mineral. It's got different vegetables on it and, um, they're saying little things like the onion is crying and the potatoes saying, not my better half. And the broccoli saying, you're tearing me apart. And then the carrot is saying, you don't care it about me. Anyway, I don't know. And then I, I can't tell what the tomato is saying. Like at all. It's really faint. It's saying, stay back, something, something. Stay back. Or maybe that's a pepper. Oh, it's a pepper with pepper spray. I got it now. Okay, so stay back, something, something with pepper spray. I don't know. I didn't really get it for the witty vegetables. I thought the it could just say vegetable murder board, and that, that would be enough because that's what made me laugh, and we kind of need some new cutting boards in our life. And that was, I think, $11. Of course, with this, I have to pull up the rest of uh, See All Items, which is what I'd like to do. I'd like to see all my items, please and thank you. One Piece Chopping Board, $11.99 is what I paid for it. And it's now eight seventy four, which is quite the deal. And now I can blow this up and see what it says. It says, "Stay back, I've got pepper spray." Look at how the one, my one. Um, this is my honest review. This isn't sponsored by Timu. My honest review is in the picture. You can see how dark the vegetables and their little sayings are. But then, oh man, look at my battery. <laughs> the real thing, not so much. It's kind of hard. So that's my only really complaint about it. Happy birthday, mom. So what do we have for her now? We've got the vegetable murder board. We've got hairspray that she likes. We've got a gift certificate to her hair salon. And we've got that heating pad for hopefully her back and or her stomach. So that's all. That's what I'm doing. 
Okay, the next thing in here, so we got mom taken care of for her birthday, which is Monday. Not this coming, yeah, this coming Monday, holy cow. Okay, so next in here is, I saw it, and so I'm trying to, I'm trying to pull it up before I pull it out. <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm trying to... What with my filthy mind? I'm trying to pull up the order before I get the item out of the bag. Okay, look at me blushing because that just sounded so wrong. Okay, two-piece polyester hand towel with red birds. These are cardinals and we love cardinals. Everyone, well, mo many people who have lost a loved one love cardinals because they kind of symbolize a loved loved one that we've lost maybe he's popping in for a visit or something i mean i hope not i mean i would hate to think my dad is flying around as a cardinal now but you know what i mean so this is really soft like a like a bath towel really it feels more like a bath towel than like a linen kitchen towel but there are two of them and you can kind of see the material there. They're soft and they're pretty. I got them for the kitchen because right now we still have Halloween ones up on our kitchen towel rack and it's time to change them and they're beautiful. And they are $5.39 for two of them. They come as a set, meaning they don't make you buy two of them. I have yet to, um, I still haven't had Timu tell me that I've had, that I have to buy two of something, but I'll let you know when it happens to me. And I also have been seeing from some people that Timu has made it a $20 order minimum for free shipping. For me, it's still 10. I'm not special or anything. I think it's slow, just like it takes a while to roll it out among all the hundreds and thousands of Timu users. This one I thought would make my mom laugh. So this might be another birthday present. And why, really? It's in the other order that we just got out of. Come on. That's Loki down there. Loki is my cat, if you're new to my channel. And see all items there it is there it is four dollars and 48 cents it says it's making me laugh i'm gonna keep it in the plastic it says sometimes i open my mouth and my mother comes out and it's got the buffalo plaid on the bottom of it and kind of like a retro painting and a cool font and this is a set of hmm one piece funny buffalo plaid kitchen towel so I think it's only one towel kitchen towel is it two I don't know oh, here comes the wrecking ball wrecking things Loki oh you scared me Loki it's a blackout Loki, get down. Loki, can you get down, please? Oh, for a minute, the whole world shifted sideways and I didn't know what was going on. All right, I wish I could open that for you and tell you if there are one or two in there. I think it's just, it says one piece, so I think there's just one in there. But I can't even tell you the material, but I need to leave that wrapped because I'm going to give that to her for her birthday too. Okay, next in here is I got one of these. I was on a hairstyling kick and so I got one of these, these hairstyling hot combs. No, hopefully it's a blow dryer. It's what I use now. I use what an old one by Revlon now, and I don't like the new ones by Revlon. So I'm always looking for one that's kind of like my old school Revlon one. And I was hoping maybe this would be it. Let's take it out and take a look and see if it has a cord 
or if you have to charge it. If you have to charge it, that might be kind of interesting. It would be nice to use it and not have it plugged in the wall. I might have to use this to open up this. Okay. Because I just can't get things open, you guys. I just can't get th things open. If you listen to me, I think it was yesterday. Was it yesterday? Did I do a haul yesterday? I don't know. It all blends into one day. You might have heard my story about how Amazon delivered my packages to some random house that I didn't even recognize. You know how you can track your package and what is going on here? And it'll show you a photo of the package having been, after it's been delivered. And it was at some random doorstep that I totally didn't recognize even as one of my neighbors or anything. And I, it took me forever to get a real person on the phone and blah, blah, blah. They refunded me my money and they were going to send the order again today. So they did. And so then I get this notification and it says, your package has been delivered. And I pull it up to look at it and it's at some other strange house. It's not my house. So I got customer service on the phone. I was like, what is going on? What? Why can't this driver figure out my address and what is happening here? And I don't think the customer service person spoke English very well. And she just said, I am putting it in my annotations and blah, blah, blah. So they ended up refunding me again. And she said, do you want us to send you this stuff again? And I said, no, just forget it. I'm done with you, Amazon. Okay, so it's got a little power button on, and it's, yeah, I mean, hopefully it'll be, and what I like about it is this tip, because what I don't like about that one that I bought, I bought, I hauled another one that had, was in a beautiful box with a bunch of different, uh, like, heads that you could switch. Well, all of those have flat tips, which is why it comes with a glove, because it gets really hot to hold, and I don't have time for the glove. I don't have time to switch the glove on each hand and whatever, so I'm going to try, I'm going to try, I'm going to try this, and we'll see how it works. And then the horrible thing is, I ordered this again on accident. I ordered it twice. Because Timu put it back in my feed and I totally forgot that I had ordered it in this order. So you'll be seeing that again in a couple of weeks, but I'll probably put that in my stuff to give away box. Okay, this is a cat. Yeah, I'm immature. I don't care. It's a big, fluffy cat, black cat. And it makes a lot of noise getting it out. Except this one has a tail. Wish you could, can I rip this apart? Ooh, I'm gonna cut it. I'm gonna cut it. Oh no, here comes speaking of black cats. Hey, Loki, no. Oh, I'm sorry you guys. Okay, I cut the tail. Sorry, I just, I wanted it to not do that. And here's its cute face. Cheese, cheese. So what I do is, yeah, I pose like this for pictures. And then I go back and watch the replay before I upload it. And I um, take a screenshot of whatever I like for a thumbnail and then I upload it in the editing process. So that's why I'm always going cheese. Okay. That was Loki trying to eat it here. Loki, get it. All my stuffed animals, man, this cat, I've seen him carry around a stuffed animal three times his size. He loves them. He loves to get them and kick them and roll around on the floor with them. He's a funny little dude. Okay, there's a here's a box and it's heavy too. Oh, that little that cat. I don't know how much that cost, you guys. And I do know where it is. I know exactly where it is. It is up here. It is right there. 
and it is, and here are those lipsticks from yesterday. If you watched my haul yesterday, those nude lipsticks were $1.79. The thermal heated brush that I just showed you was $21.77. Woo! That's expensive. It better be awesome. It's still $21.77. And this cat I paid $8.30 for, and it is... six dollars and 78 cents now and i did get a price adjustment on it okay this is heavy and i have no idea what it is not a clue and i can't read that so i don't know i'm mystified let me get it open so amazon i I've never, you know how long I've been ordering things from Amazon since the beginning of time, and I have never had this happen before where the delivery person keeps dropping it off at the wrong, not my house. And I asked the customer service person, can you see anything about my address that would make it confusing? Oh, I thought this was really beautiful. Please don't be broken. Okay, this is a really beautiful it's a really beautiful canister to put coffee or tea in or whatever you want. And I've got some or yeah, whatever you'd like, but I will show it to you. This is the lid. Okay, hold on a second. And then this is the canister. It is beautiful yellow stone no ceramic -y kind of oh it's got little feet which is good it's got so here it is with the lid on it cheese it looks like something you'd find at an antique store or something <laughs> i don't know why i always do that with my eyebrows gritting my teeth okay Anyway, pretty. The design goes all the way around it. It comes in a variety of colors with different types of birds. But I really love this yellow one. And I think I paid $16 for it or something. It's definitely not a Timu Wow deal. It was definitely a little bit pricey as far as Timu goes. And it's easy to find. There it is. I was going to say it's easy to find because it's bright yellow. Three different orders. Three orders in one bag. $16.33. And it is now $20.42. Wow. You can get it in green or red too if you don't want yellow. I'll just hold up my phone. There it is in like a mint green, which I almost got. And then there's a red back there. But I really love the bright sunny yellow. And that's going to look really pretty in our kitchen. But mom, we've always had this thing. I'm going to put coffee in it or candy in it or I don't know, something in it. I'm going to put something in it. That's what it's for, to put something in. Okay. This down here. My nose is starting to run. Where's a Kleenex? Just in case I need one, let me get a, not a Kleenex, but like a big wad of toilet paper. I went out, I went out there and helped my mom carry in a pizza and it was, it's freezing out there literally. And then my nose got all cold and runny in the cold runny weather okay this thing that i'm about to take out of the bag is right here or not yes there it is okay this retro fuzzy cross body bag is sold out 
and I paid $15.98 for it. And please don't let, it's the same kind of vibe as the other one, but it's smaller. Okay, tell me if something starts just dripping out of my nose. I have people in my comments who say, I always miss these lives. This isn't live. I don't do lives. They turn into a circus. I do have channel moderators. I don't know where they are or if they would, I don't know, but I just, lives in my case turn out. Okay, this is more like what I was looking for. This is like a faux suede and it feels like it and it's got a cool, it's got cool fleece lining. It's a cool little mini bag and I like it. It matches those boots that I showed you yesterday and it matches it snap it looks like it both buckles but thankfully it snaps it matches everything with fleece it does have a long strap thankfully and the inside of it has got a zippered pocket and that's it no slip pockets but it does have an, a an inner zippered pocket and then the back is plain and the bottom is you know plain and it's just nice it's a nice cute little purse and it is sold out i put notify me so if anyone has a burning desire to get it i will notify you in my community feed if i get a notification that it's back in stock Okay, um, there's going to be some crinkling. How long have we been doing? Only 30 minutes? Okay, we might actually get through this whole bag. All three orders. Oh, I ordered a lot of pins. Okay, I got this because it made me laugh. And it is $2.98. <laughs> It's a cosmetic bag. You guys know I like to run around with big tote bags. So I, all the cosmetic bags I like because they help keep my tote bag. Ooh, and I do have those purse organizers, but I like the cosmetic tote. I like the cosmetic bags. And it says there's probably drugs in here. <laughs> it just makes me laugh. It's got it on both sides, and it is $2.98. Now, it's very, very flimsy. It's not worth $2.98 at all. It is worth about 50 cents. I cannot even tell you how light and flimsy this is. Like, I could probably punch a hole in it if I tried hard enough. So, I'm a little disappointed it's not a thicker, more sturdier canvas. It's it's totally not worth three dollars. That's not a good team deal. There's probably drugs in here. It is funny though. I will link I will try to link to all these orders in my description, but I can't make any promises, you guys. I got a brooch. It is the moon. I paid $179 for it and it is now $148. Oh my yeah, I can't find it. Whatever. It's now $148. There's the sun. Oh, I didn't know they had the sun. Okay. You can get a uh it's kind of cheesy looking. I don't know. Maybe it's not cheesy looking. Maybe I just need an attitude adjustment. Maybe I need some food. Here it is. It is the moon with a planet and some sparkly little sparkles all around it. And it's, it's okay. I mean, people can't really tell what it is. It looks like just a gold squiggly mess, but when you pin it on, but it's okay. It's just, it's very light and flimsy as in it feels like a bubble gum machine type thing that you get in a bubblegum machine but it was only 148 I paid 179 but I did get a price adjustment for it so there is that
everybody who's got their shot glasses out, do a shot. If you're new to my channel, people do shots whenever I buy some fingernails or bracelet charms. So here's some pretty do-it-yourself. 24 pieces, wow, of delicate, comfortable fingernails. And I, I thought they were really pretty. And I don't know how much those were. I'm going to say five bucks or something. Well, I'll let you know when I see them. Okay, the next thing in here are a pair of, another pair of Pac-Man socks. And I paid $1.61 for them. But these, I don't have any like these. These have a red toe and they're, they're mainly, and a red heel. And they're mainly the ghosts with some Pac-Man. I just like Pac-Man socks and they are now $125 and I did get a price adjustment on these. Pac-Man Fever. Do you guys remember that song Pac-Man Fever in the 80s? Driving me crazy, going out of my mind. That's scary that I can remember a lot of the lyrics to Pac-Man Fever. Okay, do another shot because it's a more do-it-yourself. Valentine's Day nails. Now those thumbs look really big. I don't know, but I know I desperately need to put something on soon because uh, I'll let you know how much those cost when I see them. Right now I'm working on this order. Now this bag, you guys, what? Oh, well, there's a hole in it right there. I was going to say this bag feels like it's a little better quality than that last ripped up bag, but now that I look at it, I am seeing a bunch of holes. But if anything fell out, I guess I'm just too tired to care anymore. I'm just, they've broken me. They've broken my spirit. I did get contacted by Timu PR after that bag, after that video. With, so they're watching, they're watching me. After that video with the bag with all the holes in it, I got an email from Timu PR to this channel's email and it said, tell us what items are missing and we'll send them to you. I've already ordered them again, so I don't, I didn't do it, but these are little earrings of Bigfoot walking through the forest. They're a lot smaller than I thought they would be. Once again, nobody's going to be able to tell what's on them from far away, but they're okay. I mean, they're fine. They're fine. They kind of blend into skin a little bit. I just, I thought they were going to be kind of big honking ones. There's my cat pooping again in the litter box. I paid 89 cents and they are sold out. Sorry. They suck. Forget it. They're horrible. You don't want them anyway. No, I'm kidding. Now I feel kind of self-conscious because, well, if Timu, P if Timu PR is watching this channel, could I get some influencer love, please? And not just the kind in the influencer program. Like, can I get a t-shirt or something? Or could I get an official paid sponsorship or anything? No, hi, Luna. Here comes the Luna. Get down, Luna. You can't get up there. There's no room. Luna, there's no room. Sorry, you guys. I'm sorry. Luna, get down. I'm trying to train my cats. Speaking of Bigfoot, these are little... Oh, no, they're not. Oh, these are small... These are hard to explain. They are lace-up... They look like corset laces and then the bows hang down past your ear. But they're so small, they're kind of pointless. I'll show you the picture of them. Look at my face. Let me fix this. Okay, I wish I wouldn't have looked at that pizza. I want that pizza now. Cute bunny. I don't know how much I paid for those. 
I don't know. Hold one second, please. Thank you for your patience. While I try to find those earrings, I just want to show you what they were supposed to look like. Here they are. They look like exquisite white ribbon bow design. Now they look huge on this chick's ear. And they are teeny tiny. Objects in mirror may be closer than reality or what is it that the thing says on my little side mirror? I don't know, but I'm getting this out. Now look at that, stop it. Okay, hold it like this so you don't have... It's this small. It doesn't even really look like laces. I don't know. It looks crystal clear and well cut there. And here it just kind of looks like a blob with... Strings hanging down. I thought they would be a hoop. A hoop to wear those. What did I pay for those? Well, they are now 89, eight, they're 89 cents, which is what I paid for them. I paid 80 cents for them. So why am I whinging about it? Just forget it. What do you expect for 80 cents? This is another little Pac-Man pin and I've already bought this and I accidentally bought it again because that's how we roll. So I'm going to put that in my giveaway pile. And I heard from, is it Mary? I heard from one of my winners. She received her box yesterday and I mailed two of my winners boxes out Tuesday and I'm very proud of myself for doing that. And I find that it was like a big weight. Now these are really awesome star earrings. Now these are what I call, okay. Okay, that's what I'm talking about right there. They hang down, leave me alone, I'm a star. They're shiny too. No, they're not moissanite. They're just really sparkly. I like them. Here comes the wrecking ball. He came in like I wish, I love him very much with all my heart and soul, but I just wish he would not do that while I'm, I gotta put on my eyes. Okay, those white French nails that I showed you, those are 143. And then the ones with the little hearts on them were one and bows are 179. So those are the fingernail prices. Now wait a minute. There's supposed to be a pair of Huh. The stars are 179. And they're supposed to come with them and they're sold out. And they are supposed to come with a matching moon necklace. I don't know. You guys, I bought a little snowman brooch. Because I feel... Ugh. Yeah, I can wear it in the winter time. I'm trying to hold it up without showing my disgusting shattered fingernails. It looks like this. Look at the cute red nose and the little red bow in the hat. Very cute. The little sparkly scarf. I love this snowman brooch. In the meadow we can build a snowman and pretend we bought him on Timu. Okay, he was 68 cents. And he's now a dollar seventeen. Now hold on a minute. You can get him in gold or you can get him in silver. If you get him in gold, he's a dollar seventy-seven. If you get him in silver, he's a dollar seventeen. I got him for sixty-eight cents, so I'm not sure how that happened. I got another one. Wait, does it have bad words on it? No. 
It made me laugh. And it says, feed me tacos and tell me I'm pretty. And it's got it on both sides. And it's a better material than, no, they're both kind of light, but they're still funny. Feed me tacos and tell me I'm pretty. And I saw a sweatshirt that they had on Timu that said, feed me Chick-fil-A and tell me I'm pretty. And I thought, well, now why would I want to run around and advertise Chick-fil-A for free when they're not even giving me a free chicken sandwich? Feed me tacos and tell me I'm pretty. Could you imagine whispering that in some guy's ear? If some guy, you know these guys, they always go talk dirty to me. And you go, feed me tacos and tell me I'm pretty. <laughs> I'm turning red again, <laughs> blushed. I can't talk about those adult topics without blushing. Totally blushing. Oh, that's a pretty shade. I wish I had a blush like that. A real blush. Okay, that was $2.98 for that, and it's still $2.98. All right. What in the Sam Hill is this? A CD? Oh, I got this for my boss. If you're my boss, look away. Part of your birthday present. They are cat lovers pen sets. They say, I just want to pet all the cats. They say, ask me about my cat. Sorry I'm late. My cat was napping on me, which totally has happened to me before. Cats are better than people. Cats are cheaper than therapy. I don't like the way the text is like running into the end. Like this orange one now the text is totally running up on this it's got all this space right here for pete's sake but anyway they're cute and if i recall correctly they were like shockingly expensive not like hundreds of dollars or anything but they were for a set of pens they were kind of like what and then i got a spin the wheel deal and I think I picked these pens and got them at a reasonable price. So here they are. If you thought you were going to have to wait a long time, you were wrong. Because here they are. And they were, oh no, they were $6.29. Now that is, and now they're $8.09. Wow. And you can get dogs too. They have dog lover pens, and I have no idea what that says. It says dogs are better than people. Dogs are cheaper than therapy. Hi, can I pet your dog? Sorry, I can't. I have plans with my dog, and ask me about my dog. So they do have, if you want to pay eight bucks, you can get a dog lover's pen set. And I kind of want to keep that cat lover's pen set. We'll see how nice my boss is to me. Okay, the next thing in here is a fake braid. Now, okay. I'm stuck on walking in a winter wonderland now. Whoa, okay, now it's got a big, so I guess you put your hair back and then, I don't know if I can do this. Am I coordinated enough to do this? Then you use this to tie, <laughs> no. I'm not doing it right, but I do want to see what the, so I'm really tying this on tight with this rope, but I think you should probably put your hair up in a ponytail holder first and then put this on over it or not. I don't know. It's got a little ponytail wig on it. Look at my long Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. 
how that would be fun to have that. It's really heavy, so you probably need to pin it with bobby pins. Does it have little pins on the inside? Yes, it does. And it's got little combs on the inside so you can cram it. Okay, I don't want to really know what the back looks like. Here's with the front. <laughs> Yay! Leave me alone. I've got long hair. Woo! It's it's so long though, but it kind of matches. And then there's the back. That's pretty. Aw. I feel pretty oh so pretty with it. Kinda. <laughs> it looks like a snake. I'm delighted though. It delights me. Okay. How much is that? I think it's it was about five bucks because I almost bought two of them because I wasn't sure what color. So I'm going to say it was about five bucks. And it makes me smile. And I'm going to go downstairs and be like, Mom, where's the pizza? <laughs> yes, I'm a child living with my mom. Somebody put that in comments. Don't get all whatever. It didn't bother me. I am a child living. You're living like a child with your mom. My mom's really sick. She cannot live by herself and she does not want to go live in a, uh, an assisted living facility. So if it weren't for me, that's where she'd be. So that this is me doing my good deed. Okay, $6.47. It comes in a whole bunch of... Now, yeah, so here's what it, here's what it looks like. So I don't know, am I supposed to fluff this out? I'm scared. I don't want to ruin it though. Or is it supposed to stay tight? I mean, it's all fluffed out in the picture. <gasps> I'm going to fluff it out a little because it does look like a snake. But no, I'm scared, you guys. Oh, you could even untie it? Don't untie it for Pete's sake. I don't... I'm fluffing it a little bit. I don't... What does the brown one look like? Is the brown... Oh, the, look, here's the instructions. Lace net, breathable and comfortable, adjustable drawstring. Oh, that's what that is. I used it to tie up my hair and shove it in there with two small clips. It's really nice. It feels really nice. And it comes in black, blonde, dark brown. Yeah, they all look kind of fluffed out in all these pictures, but I'll mess with it later. It comes in like a pink. Pinkish. It comes in like a white blonde. It comes in like a dark blonde. Honey blonde. Wow. I mean, you could just go nuts. It comes in seven colors. And, okay. Next thing, we have some fine jewelry. For $5.98. I paid $6.47. And I did not get a price adjustment, Timu. Fine jewelry. I don't, I don't. I didn't buy any moist tonight. Oh, this is another one of those boxes. And this is a little delicate silver. <laughs> that I can't get open. One of those boxes that I can't get open. It says push, okay. I'm the kind of person that they have to write the word push for. It's a little chain with little stations of little different color gems. I thought that I thought it would be bigger, but it's pretty. It's a pretty little delicate chain. Okay. We love Timu. Yeah, you know, I'm going to put it back in this little box. That is how small and delicate it is. I'm happy with it. 
You have to get really close to my neck if you want to see it. And it cost, I don't know, maybe $7 and 20, yes. It costs $7.21. Personality, silver, um, multicolor, zircone, zircone, zirconia, zirga, zircone, zircon. I don't know. I don't buy it, so I don't know. I buy real diamonds and moissanite and glass. Get this crinkly stuff out of my life. Hold on a minute, please. Goodbye. Oh, the hand. No. Okay, we're gonna, don't you worry. We're gonna get this all set up. The hello sign is all right. The hand is okay. Everything's fine. It's all fine. Oops, I just unplugged it. Okay, the hello sign is not okay. We are going to try to put it right back there. Okay, it says hello in white now. It's resting on the Chanel rose. Oh, am I flashing everybody? Fix my... Sorry, I got to adjust my chest. All right, what else is in here? Let's get back to work. I can't... All this trash now is on the ground, so I can't... Plug it back in. The chaos. The chaos, though. The sheer chaos of it all. I'm still going to doggedly try. I don't know if I can reach the plug. I can try to reach the plug. I can't reach the plug, but I gave it my best shot just for you. Okay, the next thing that we have in here, what is this, 56 minutes? Yeah, I. do we have time to do all of this? Don't get impatient, that takes away all the fun. For a dollar 48, oh, it looks so sad and lonely. I wish I could pause it, tap the screen. If I tap the screen, it just focuses where I tap it. If I hit the space bar, nope, it's still recording. <laughs> that didn't do anything. Okay, I got some little leprechaun <laughs> earrings. <laughs> Yay, happy St. Patrick's Day week. What day is St. Patrick's Day on? I mean, I know it's the 17th, but what day of the week I'm going to have to ask my boyfriend. I'm sorry. If you've got a device, an Echo Dot or anything like that, you might want to mute it for a minute. Alexa, what day of the week is St. Patrick's Day on this year? Good evening, Erin. St. Patrick's Day will be on Sunday, March 17th, 2024. It's on a... By the way, you have three new notifications. Do you want to hear them? No, thank you. Creepy. Okay. Um, so I won't, it's not like we're, I'm going to be at work on St. Patrick's Day and I doubt I'm going to go. Well, there is an Irish pub that we all kind of hang out at on, on St. Patrick's Day. I don't know if we're going to be doing that this year or not. That seems like a long way away. So I don't know, but I'll wear them on camera and I'll wear them Friday. Okay, next, these are my, another pair of my favorite, another favorite of all time earrings. They are pills. They're pills that hang from hearts. Why? Thank you. They're little pink and white. <laughs> now, I don't know. And I got, the funny thing is I have a matching necklace with a little pink and white pill. So it's all funny to me, but I don't know what, what, normal people normal I don't know what normal people would think if they saw those but those were 94 cents and they are sold out shoot I'm sorry you guys I didn't mean to get that excited about them but I'm sure they're around somewhere I'm trying to find them from another seller but I can't I can't find them okay all right 
Next is a little ring. Oh no, I don't want to model a little ring with these fingers. And I don't know how much it costs, but when we see it, I will let you know. It's not moist tonight, but it is kind of a leave me alone, I'm engaged. It is a size five, so I got it for leave me alone, I'm engaged. And I've got long hair. Leave me alone. Oh no! It's, well, it's very tight. And it's got kind of a blue tint to it. It's very pretty. Eh, I don't know, next to the moissanite, it looks a little glassy, doesn't it? Leave me alone. I'm engaged to a very broke man and I don't care. It's okay. It's fine. It's whatever. It's not moissanite, but you know, it's, yeah, okay. What did I pay for it though? What if I paid moissanite type prices for it? I doubt it. I'll be very, I'll be filled with rage. I'll be filled with silent, seething rage. Wow, there's a lot of jewelry. This really is a Timu jewelry. I can't say the word. There it is. Men, simple, trendy. Yeah, it was a dollar forty-eight, and it is kind of like your standard bubblegum machine ring. So, oh well, we tried, we tried. These are sacred heart earrings. Y'all know I love those sacred hearts. These are a lot of earrings. I don't know if I should just flat out call this a Timu jewelry haul. They're kind of brassy. Oh, stop. And is the design on both sides? No. Design's on one side, and I don't even know if you can really tell that that's a sacred heart from far away. I mean, you'd have to be like making out with me or something to see. Well, I don't know if I lean way back and the light is just right. Maybe you could tell that's a heart. And who knows what I paid for those. When I see them, I'll tell you. That's called speed running. I'm not really speed running the haul. I'm taking my time. But I... But meanwhile, now I'm looking for them. I know we are running long. We're at an hour and two minutes. And I mean, even my good friends are going to bail on this. They're going to be like, look, we got to go to bed. <laughs> I listened to this morning in the shower. I listened to Menopause and Madness's haul. It was great. And I woke up and watched Favorites with Laura. And then I got in the shower and I watched Menopause and Madness. <laughs> well, no, I didn't watch in the shower. I just listened to it while I showered. So that was an intimate moment between me and YouTube. Oh, these are sold out, but another seller has them for $148. And that is exactly what I paid for them. And I wonder if the other seller has like... I mean, they look so cool in the picture that I feel sad. Like, here they are in the picture. Should I take off this braid? I look a little haggard. Okay, these are... I don't know what this is. I don't know. I don't know. Have I posed for a thumbnail with anything? I hope so, because I sure as heck ain't doing it with the braid on. No one will recognize me. They'll think I'm like a... Oh, this is a very delicate little chain. Look at my wreck. Go ahead and look at them. They're wrecked. That's what fingernail glue and yanking off fingernails will do to your nails. Very, very, very... Once you start gluing on nails, you're doomed. 
No, Loki, for the love of all that's holy, you cannot get up here right now. Loki, no. Loki, no. Loki, go, go put the pizza in the oven. Oh. How's my mom do? I'm going to text my mom and see if she could stick that pizza in the oven for me. Hey, mom. What are you doing? Can you... I can't get this out, you guys, but the gist of it is it's a little, it's got stations that are little clovers. Can you see it? And if I pull it, it's going to, I'm going to have to cut this. Bag open, maybe. Okay, gosh. So... There it is. It's got a clover hanging down. Oh, that's the back. What? Oh, there's where you fasten it. It's got a clover hanging down. It's got little circles with gems. It's really pretty. It's just very delicate. It's. I think they were going for a Louis Vuitton vibe with the shapes. But it's another dainty little necklace. It's so dainty and small. And I don't know what I paid for that. Here it is. Sterling silver personality. No. Earrings necklace. No. Sterling silver four leaf clover. Six dollar. No. Is that a six or is it an eight? I did order some eyeglass chains. So I can officially be a little old lady. I don't think they're in here though. I paid eight dollars and fifty four cents for that. I got par I got a price adjustment. It's now seven forty seven. Okay. Next is a really cool pin. It's a big safety pin with a lucky cat hanging off it and a bunch of other little charms. Look at that. That's cool. And they slide around. Oh, wait a minute. One of them? No. Okay, I was about to say one is gone. No, they don't slide around. They don't move. They're very jangly. And I love this thing. It's cool. Hold it up close to the camera at the request of some people. Pretty. Well, it's not pretty, but it's cute. Cute and pretty, pretty and cute. Okay, the next thing I got. Are some little Bigfoot studs. And they are little. You can't even tell they're Bigfoot. There he is. Whoop. There he is. Bigfoot studs. <laughs> I'm wearing these tomorrow. No one can, t <laughs> well, if the light hits just, just right. Like if I had a light shining there, you can totally, it looks like Bigfoot. I don't know. Bigfoot studs. I wish they were bigger. I wish they were bigger. It's Bigfoot, for Pete's sake. Make them big and bold. Be dainty and small with Bigfoot. This is a pin that says, Don't give up. You can cuss the whole time. Just don't give up. And I like it. And it's something we should all remember. It came with two backs. That was thoughtful of them. Don't give up. You can cuss the whole time. Just don't give up. That was $1.48 or I paid $1.48 and it's still... Oh no, that's not the right one. But that's probably $1.48 too. This one, my friends, I got another one of my little acrylic girls. I don't know, this is just a little hippie chick, but isn't she cute? 
I'm excited about. I love these acrylic. I've got Marilyn Monroe. I've got Audrey Hepburn. Now I've got this little girl. Do I have Frida too? I don't know. Frida, but she's pretty. She's cheese. No, I don't want my fingernail right there. Here. <laughs> Oh, the hello sign isn't even on. Forget it. Forget it. All right. I love this one. This is one of my favorite things in this haul. So there's that. A little tie. Yeah, a little pin makes me that happy. And this braid. I'm going to wear. Could you imagine? I could put a hat on. Do I have a hat anywhere within reach? No. Here she is. I found her. I found her. She is. I love those acrylic pins. Bigfoot studs were 98 cents and they are now still 98 cents and they only have them in black. The cute colorful acrylic brooch with the girl is, I paid 289 and she is now 254 and you can get her in all kinds of colors. Green, blue, red, and then the color I got, which is like pinky purple. Purple, pinky, pink. So, very cool. The don't give up, you can cuss the whole time, just don't give up, was $1.34 and is now $1.48. Look at me cruising through those prices. That Fortune Cat pin was $2.48 and it's still $2.48. It's cute. I love that. All right, all right. We just cruise through some prices. This is another pin that says, I'm, I think it says, this is me trying, which is how I feel at work some days. Not today, today was a good day. It was very productive and I got a bunch of new projects I'm working on. So I'm happy when I have a lot of work at work. It says, this is me trying, but it's so small that people would have to get right up on your chest to even see what they said. But I'm not going to wear it like that anyway. I'm just going to put that on my mood bag. Now, I don't know if it was simply Jessica Marie or Holler Time who started putting pins on mood bags. Oh my gosh, a ring fell out and I almost threw it away. But somebody started putting pins on the mood bag and now we're all kind of doing it. So I got to work on mine. Okay, a ring fell out, another little ring. It's a size seven and it is really gold, color of gold, or maybe it's rose gold. What are we doing on time? One hour and 12? I hope I've got batteries left. I bet I can smell the pizza. Oh, it's another Clada ring, Irish. <gasps> Oh, my seven finger is suddenly an eight. Oh my gosh, I have got to stop eating cake. Stop eating cake. Time for me to hit the gym. I'm just kidding, I hate the gym. Okay, this one is okay, you know. It's cool. It's whatever. It's a little busy. You can't really tell what's going on. And I don't know what I paid for that. I will. Oh, there it is right there. Elegant promise ring. I paid $1.48 for it. That's why you, oh no, that's not, that's not the right ring. Gosh, I bought a lot of cheap rings. I don't know. When I see it, I'll let you know. These are fleece lined jeans and I don't know you guys and they are taped to the inside of the bag I feel like this is going to be one of those bags that I lose things out of yeah so they look thick and they look like farmer's jeans. Now, I really like Timu's jeans so far. But these, I don't know because I've never seen 
Oh Lord, here we go again with the white patches on them. Oh, it's not that bad. Um, the butt looks huge. Well, I got it in an 810 and look at the inside. <laughs> You're going to wear these when it's five degrees out and you're going to be laughing at all your cold friends, even though they're going to be like, did you get those jeans at a hardware store or what the, or at your local farm? I don't know. They kind of look like farmer, je farmer jeans and I would try them on, but I'm scared. No, I got to do some try-on videos. I've got to do a Halara try-on their outfits. And I've got to do this company that sold all their stuff on, sells their stuff on Amazon. They sent me 10 outfits that I've got to try on and do a video. So you're going to get to see my legs again. And people are going to go, oh my gosh, she has legs. Those jeans are, these jeans go on when I close my eyes. Okay, these jeans are high waist, warm winter, straight leg, fleece lined, $19.96. And yeah, man, I mean, when you roll up the bottom, really? Yes, here's the bottom of the leg and you can roll them up and be like, hey, everybody, look at my fleece jeans and my braid. I might wear this tomorrow, especially with the hat on over it. And just flick my braid at people. Shut up. <laughs> okay, I gotta hurry. I smell the pizza. I smell it. What time? Oh, it's only 7 o'clock. I thought it was like 9.30. It's going to be 9.30 by the time I upload this. Thank you to all of you who watch my videos at night. For those of you who wait until the next day, I totally understand. This ring was $1.48. I know because I just looked at it on accident. Not on accident, but I thought it was the other ring. But I got it in a size 6. So I must have got it for the leave me alone. I'm engaged finger. It is a really rose gold and it's, it's obnoxious. Take this one off. Take this $1.48 ring off and put this $1.48 ring on. I mean, I mean, you know, it's fine. It's got little roses that you can't really cover my face that you can't really see and some little sparklies all around it it's okay it looks like it's cutting off my circulation and it kind of is <laughs> get it off oh no what has happened to my leave me alone i'm engaged will it fit on this finger no i've got <sighs> Oh, Lord, I've got to start eating some salads. I've been eating an apple a day. Now, granted, they've been caramel apples, but still, they count, right? An apple a day keeps the doctor away and fills you up with fiber and does all kinds of good things. And the caramel and the chocolate chips on them, those are just added bonuses. No, I'm, I'm just not, you guys. This is another, I was on a tiny little chain kick and I just can't. First of all, I don't even remember ordering that. And it is so small. So dainty. I don't. Sterling silver wave glitter paperclip chain. $8.06. Is that what that is? My lips are bothering me. I put drying lipstick on them. I don't know. I have no idea. I'm guessing, I'm wondering if this is 
this, in which case I'm disappointed if it is. If not, I don't know. That was $8.06. We'll see. I bought a rabbit brooch for Easter and it is cute. Wait, this isn't the right thing. We're almost done. In it for the long haul. Look at how cute that is. That is adorable. Little flowers, little red eyes, little cute bunny. Happy Easter, everybody. Okay. I'm going to hate putting all this stuff away. I'm going to hate it so much. So much. I got some Christmas candy cane earrings, beaded candy cane earrings, because I was bummed that I did not get these at Christmas time. I really like these a lot. They look a little yellowish, but yeah, I got those. I'll just put them with my Christmas jewelry and I'll wear them next year. Then I got this set of three necklaces. I'm interested to see. Oh, good. They come separate in separate things in case you want to give them away to people, which I might. This one has mushrooms, and I definitely want to give that away. I'm not a mushroom person. I know there are a lot of people who are. But this one has got mushrooms in a forest. This one has got Bigfoot that says Believe. And this one has got a UFO that is sucking up Bigfoot or just shining its little light on him. I don't know. Cute. So all three of those, it was a real deal. That was like an old school Timu type deal. Let me see if they were in this order. Because I would like to tell you how much those cost. And the one thing I'm really excited to get, they, oh, here it is. Oh, and there's the Clada ring. Okay. Elegant promise ring with the roses. That was 148. The cute bunny animal brooch, 198. And he is sold out. Bunny is sold out. Sorry. But they'll have more. Three pieces, Pine, Witch, Moon, Sasquatch, $3.98 for all three. Candy cane earrings, $2.98. Partially refunded, they're now $2.39. And here is the moon necklace that goes with those star earrings that I showed you. Fingernails have got gunk in them. It's not dirt. It's like makeup or eyeshadow or something in my fingernails. But in this light, it looks they look gunky. Sorry about that. Gunky fingernails. Fingernails. Why are you obsessed with your nails? Because I hate it when they look bad. This is beautiful moon necklace i really like it and yeah it's it's pretty and i think it was like three dollars and 48 cents or something they came with the star no you they didn't come together but you had to buy it with the star you could buy it with those star earrings and i did okay what else? We almost done. We just got a little tiny, like a bunch of little odds and ends. I got a Rosie the Robot pin from the Jetsons. There she is. Very nice. We love. And she was a die paid a dollar ninety eight, and she's still a dollar ninety eight. And I think we only have two things left. I loved these pearl earrings with little rabbit ears on them. It 
Oops. They look like that. They're cute. Where do they hang? They hang from the ear, so they dangle down. Nice. Those were not very expensive, of course, because this is Timu and you get great deals on jewelry at Timu. And so these were, I do want to tell you how much these are and I do want to see if they're still in stock. Here they are right here. They are, they were 98 cents and they are out of stock, but no, nah, here they are from another seller. Just look for rabbit design stud earrings and they're $1.48. A foot is cramping and there's some more for $2.49. You can look around and totally find them. They're sold out, but not really. They're sold out from that one seller. Okay, and then this, these are goofy little plastic rings that I don't know, adjustable. plastic. What was I thinking? What was? Why? I guess I thought they would be fun. I mean, they're kind of cute. If you're wearing the right outfit and you just want to throw on like a cute little bow, a pink one, a green one, and a purple one. What did I pay for those? And what was I drinking at the time? At least they'll be easy to find because they're so colorful. There they are. They are cute candy color bow rings, $2.28. And they are still $2.28 for a set of all three. I like them. I like them. I like them. She likes them. She really likes them. Okay, get them off. Wow, this little table is covered with jewelry. I think that's it, you guys. I think that was the last thing. Let's very carefully look. That was a big, long three order haul. It is an, an hour and 27 minute mega haul. And paper is falling out and more paper is falling out. So, nope, there's nothing else in there. I'm very bummed that that paper clip, that silver paper clip-ish earring necklace is so small, but whatever. Okay, gosh, does anyone want to come over and help me clean this all up? I smell pizza. I'm going down to get pizza. I like the braid. I don't know what the back of my head looks like. I mean, I can see kind of what the side looks like, but I don't know what. <laughs> I do want to go down like this and get my pizza and think of how fun it would be. Maybe I should try to grow my hair this long. Okay, anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching and I love and appreciate you guys so much. And thank you for listening to me run my mouth. And I will try to paste all these orders in the description below. But if I can't, just let me know if there's something you're looking for. And I will find it for you. And I hope that you... Oh, I hope that you hit the thumbs up button. It really helps my channel. Or hit the thumbs down. That's fine. Somebody... I'm not paying attention to the thumbs down. Someone pointed out to me that my thumbs downs are increasing. I'm like, I don't have that little... Um, widget or whatever that people use to see the number of thumbs down. I don't pay attention to thumbs down, but thanks. And, um, but thank you for hitting a thumb, preferably the, the up one. Thank you for your kind comments down below. And thank you for being here. And I will see you guys tomorrow. 
And I hope you have a nice morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it is when you're watching this. And now we say, how do we stop this thing? Good night, everybody. The hand says good night. Hello, I'm sorry about that. At least it made it through most of the video. Okay, goodbye.